Lisa here and I want to explain really quickly why your time management skills could be costing you clients. I'm involved in a couple organizations and recently we had a committee meeting and as we were all sitting around the table um, giving our progress reports, one of the men on the committee shared that he had the best of intentions but he really didn't get his stuff done. And so I applaud him for coming right out and saying, I committed to the group, I didn't do it, I'm going to try to do better. That's awesome. However, this wasn't the first time. And I was honestly considering, after the meeting, hiring him. Because he's really good at what he does. But I didn't. And the reason I didn't is how do I know that I'm not going to get the same thing from him as a client as I do as a member of this committee? We've all volunteered our time for the good of a common goal, yet he's not given what he said he's going to give. And there could be many reasons behind that, and I'm not here to judge. What I'm saying is, his lack of time management skills directly resulted in me not choosing to hire him, even though he's really good at what he does. Because as far as I'm concerned, when I go to hire someone, I want them to be a woman or a man of their word. And so if they're going to tell me they're going to do something, I want them to do it. How are your time management skills? Are they costing you clients? Do you find that you promise to do something only to run out of time to get it done? If so, I invite you to have a conversation with me. 30 minutes, we'll talk about what's going on in your life. I'll offer you some strategies. No obligation, no pressure. If you happen to be a fit for one of my programs, I may offer it to you, but either way, the strategies are yours to keep and to run with. So take a minute, schedule a time today, and we'll chat.